If y'all made it this far, I greatly appreciate you, but I need to talk to you real quick. So just listen out at this. Now I started these wrap pants thinking that I could do like an easy project um, that didn't require a um, pattern. However, 
I made the measurements a bit too small. See, I got body and I don't be paying attention to how much body that I have. Now you tie it in the front and you tie it in the back and you see on these sides to where it does not connect. That is the effects of me cutting it too small in the waist area. See, I don't know what I was thinking. I was thinking that I was still a little skinny, little tenderoni, but I am not. I am not. I got too much booty and too much thighs. So I added these little flap areas because I was just going to sew it to the back part. Child, these big old flaps. But I was going to show sew it to the back part if you just pay attention to what I'm doing right now. And when I tell you I did not record this part because, baby, it was a disaster. It looked a hot mess. Right here, it kind of looks okay, but it looks a hot mess. And this right here, they the pants look like pajama pants. Let's start there. I tried some new fabric. I was trying the satin fabric from Walmart, y'all. This is from Walmart. I should have went to Joann's because the satin fabric is much thicker. Also, I am showing you how the pants ripped in the front of the, the pants, in the front and on the back. So yeah, thumbs down because I am not happy about this. And getting fabric from Walmart, you, you gotta do selective. It, it gotta be a selective amount. So I just wanted to say thank y'all for watching this video. I wanted to talk to y'all for a little bit and y'all have a wonderful day. Thank you for watching my video. Bye.